I'm Molly Tollett, I'm the headmaster's wife here at Horace Hill. Uh, at the moment I'm sitting in our kitchen garden uh, which we created four years ago um, and the produce that the boys learn to look after and grow and water here goes up to chef. But also the parents come and help sometimes before picking up for an exeat or a half term just to keep on top of the weeds so the boys don't get bored uh, too quickly. And that's just one of the many ways in which we encourage parents to be involved in the life of Horace Hill. We support family life, we're not trying to take away from it. Um, being a boarding school we have to work really closely with families um, and we enjoy that aspect of the role. Um, they come for weeding here but also there's coffee mornings, there are opportunities, big events like Horace Hill Day and also bonfire night. A plethora of activities that, that you can be at with your child. We both don't have a PTA, a Parents Teachers Association. All our families are important to us and the school, when you come to the school you are our guests and the boys will host you in their space. And that starts from the first moment that your child starts at Horace Hill uh, and before that we do a lot to introduce you to other families um, who your child will be spending a lot of time with their sons during the, the time that they're with us at Horace Hill. So we invite you to have play dates with them, to come here. You'll find that parents at Horace Hill are very welcoming. They're making a big decision to, to, to decide that their seven, eight year old is ready to be in a boarding environment. And therefore you'd find the community of parents as supportive to you as a family as the community of boys are to your son when he arrives here at Horace Hill. We know that our parents' lives are very busy and we want to make sure that the children are well organised for every activity that they get involved in at school. So one of the unique things of Horace Hill is we actually organise all the sports kit for the boys, including the day boys. So we upsize it when they're growing out of it, we fix it when it's broken, we sew new name tapes on it, we do the loops on it. If the child loses a sock, we solve the problem. You won't get a phone call saying, Mum, I can't play in the match today because I've lost my rugby sock. He will. We, we keep the kit here so that your boy's ready for every activity so he's not sitting in the lesson before worrying that he's not ready for the next thing that he's going to be involved in.